welcome ladies and gentlemen back to scrap mechanic survival mode and today is going to be an exciting and probably disastrous day as for the first time i am going to go to one of the big dangerous warehouses that are supposedly high risk high reward and uh i've never been in there so i'm gonna figure out what it's all about and see how well i do figuring out what it's all about but uh, first off, take a look at the harvest we got. I did a little bit of uh, farming and mining and just overall resource management uh, in between last and this episode. You can see we are almost at a full plot. I actually ran out of soil. We are three away from 100. So this is 97 crops, which means we're going to have a raid tonight. So we're going to start off this episode. Uh, we're going to farm these crops first of all. Oh, wait, those ones aren't even done yet. They're still coming in. We're going to uh, harvest these crops. We're going to wait till nighttime and probably deal with a very, very big raid. But I have an experiment that I want to do with this raid as far as defenses go. I want to test something out. So I did make one little modification. I did notice that there were these farm bot heads just laying all around like the massacres that I've uh, endured and caused with all the raids. Uh, they were just laying around my farm plots and I figured that having those loose objects just kind of hanging out here wasn't the best. So I decided to pick them all up and I put them on here as a way to intimidate the enemy when they see the heads of their fallen brethren just hanging on the edge of my base. Maybe, maybe they'll turn away and not attack. All right, come on. This is the last one. Just, just sprout. Sprout, carrot. All right, ready for this? Five, four, three, two, one. Sprout! <gasps> That was perfect. Oh, that was uh, pure luck. Pure luck that was. All right, let's go deposit our food. We're going to have a lot of stuff to package. Um, no pineapples yet, but that's not I'm hoping to find maybe some pineapples in the warehouse. So now there's a couple of things about the warehouse that I've learned despite not going there yet, just based off of comments I've seen or whatever. I think in order to get into the warehouse, I need a key card. And I think, and I'm not very happy about this, I think... And I'm also not very sure about this, but I think we need to get the key card from a big red guy, the big boss ones. I hope that's not really how it's going to go, but I that makes a lot of sense to me. So I think we're going to have to probably die a lot trying to kill a big green or a big red guy. Man, look at how many seeds I have. I have so much now for planting. So, uh, we're gonna wait for the raid, and then I'm not gonna plant, and I hope that means that we're not gonna have to deal with another raid. And we're gonna take a bunch of- we're gonna take all of our spuds with us. We have so many spuds now! Oh, I almost forgot! My idea! So, here's my idea for the raid. Ah, oh, I meant to bring more material with me. I have time. So, what I wanna do... is this. So, if you build a wall vertically, like this, you're putting one layer of distance between the farm bots and your crops, and that takes up that much material. But if you take that and you put it horizontally, you're increasing the distance a lot using much, much less material. So I'm wondering if this is a more effective way to keep them at bay, because then they have to break through in a really inconvenient way. And I think that the height, like, isn't really gonna be that important. I don't know, Ooh, we got a chest over there. All right, so presumably by doing this, we've just added 16 layers of defense to this base rather than just, you know, one or two using the same amount of blocks. So this will be interesting. All right, here they come. I think this actually works. I think this works. Wait, 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 do they go under? As long as they don't go under, we're okay. Is that all that's coming? That was like three hay bots. We have a hundred crops here, or we had a hundred crops. All right, that's interesting. All right, I'm gonna do another, I just wanna watch what happens if I'm up here. Yeah, look at this. They have to eat through 16 layers rather than just these individual ones. Okay, that works. I like it. Oh, there's a hay bot. Uh, there we go. All right, we're good. This was an easy raid. That was a surprisingly easy raid. This was the first raid I think I had since I had a hundred, almost a hundred crops. I had like 80 last time. All right, it is time. Let's head to a warehouse. Um, hopefully by the time the sun rises, I will have found one. I'm just gonna follow the roads, I guess, until I see one. Hope, wish me luck here. 
All right, guys, I took a few in-game hours, but I finally have found a warehouse. We are armed with our spud gun and hopefully enough ammo to survive this thing. And ugh, it's loading in. You can feel it loading in here. These warehouses are probably pretty intense. Oh, yeah, it's loading. It's loading. So another thing that I've also heard is that um, there might be an encryptor on in the warehouse that you have to find and until you find it you can't loot anything from the warehouse itself so where do i park my vehicle i'm gonna park my vehicle on the outside over here this feels good yeah this feels nice and calm and serene look at this place i like that all right i got my spud gun now we already see tape bots okay tape bots are easy to kill one hit on a tape bot what does he drop? What does the tape bot drop? That's this my first tape bot kill. Batteries? Is that the... Is that where I enter? Hey. All right, there we go. This is fun. This is already so much more fun. With the spud gun here. Oh, he didn't drop anything. All right, let's see. Let's see. Is this the, is this the entrance? Requires warehouse key. All right, so we're going to figure out how to get a warehouse key. Uh, the assumption... <gasps> this is where the trailer took place. Oh no, not necessarily. It's it's similar, it's similar. The trailer, at the end of the trailer was a warehouse and it looks like this is the area that the bot was um, hang, hanging out. All right, um, ooh, what is this? Is this just a bunch of stone? Can I pick this up? Wait, what? I can put it in my inventory? What is it? Stone crate? I figured I would put that on my back. Hey? Stone crate? tree crate a hay crate i've never used hay yet there's so much of these well going around the outside we're already finding some potentially useful stuff i can see stone and trees being useful because i know what that breaks down into but i have never seen anything requiring hay maybe it's for the cows maybe the cows use the hay somehow man look at this area is so cool okay i wonder if there's anything else i can find besides those on the outside where do I get the boss? Or maybe I gotta kill any boss anywhere and he gives me a key? I assumed that there would be a boss. If I needed to get the key from the boss, I assumed that it would be... He just shoot his spud gun after he was dead? I assumed that it would be at the warehouse that I need to get in. All right, I'm gonna keep looking around. If anything eventful happens, you'll be the first to... Well, actually, I'll be the first to find out and then you'll see it. Look at this place. I think this is all harvestable material. What kind of material? Oh, what kind of material is this? Oh, I'm curious what the durability is of whatever this is. We got metal and stuff. Oh, look at this stuff. This is awesome. What about, can we take that whole thing? What? What? What are these pieces? These are crazy pieces I've never seen. All right, let's check it out. Fan blade cap, decent durability. I feel like a, oh, rusted metal block. Is that useful at all? Concrete metal block, and then a regular metal block. Extruded metal block, that's decent. It's not any better than brick as far as durability goes, but okay, then we got these things. Still no boss guy though, so I don't know yet. All right, so I drove around and I found another one of these shacks and check it out, we have our first caution blocks and this is actually like a mechanism with a bearing. So we get, ooh, look at that piece. We get a free bearing. We get these other interesting pieces I haven't seen before. So there's some decent loot that you can get just from the outside. I just, I wanna be able to get to the inside. All right, so I've searched all the way around the perimeter pretty much of the uh, warehouse. So what I'm thinking is Maybe there isn't a boss assigned to each warehouse. Maybe you just got to find one in the wild and kill it. And they just drop that. But that just might be what they drop is those keys. So that's what I'm going to try to do now. I don't have no idea. It's going to get dark too. I have no idea how I'm just going to randomly find one of these guys. Man, look at this burn forest area. It's so tempting to start looting, but uh, we have a mission. There's another warehouse. There's two warehouses just connected by a single road right here. So maybe there's going to be a boss near this warehouse. Maybe we'll just get lucky and there'll be a boss like in the trailer, just right in the courtyard of the warehouse. All right. Well, there was no boss guy, uh, no sign of a key card anywhere. So I think it's going to be really hard at night, but I'm, I'm afraid I'm going to get lost too. But I think I'm just going to travel around and hope I find one of the big boss guys. Wish me luck, guys. This might take a while. <gasps> I found him. I found him. He's right over here. Okay. 
All right, I'm gonna use this rock. I'm gonna use this. Yeah, I'm gonna use this rock. Okay, here we go. Oh, he went over the rock. He went right over the rock. Okay, is he stuck on the rock? He's trying to shoot at me. Oh, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. We put a lot of bullets in him so far. What are you, where are you going? Oh. Oh. Walk me, tree. Oh, don't hit me. Oh, he's hitting me, he's hitting me. Can I run faster than him? Barely. All right, hold on, hold on. What? What? I I could have sworn he was just chasing me last I checked. <gasps> warehouse key. Component kit. We have a warehouse key. Now we need to find another warehouse. I am not anywhere near where I was before. That wasn't too bad. I don't know how much ammo I used. I wish I could have counted. All right, that was awesome. That actually worked. Spud gun is doable with those bots. Okay. Woo. All right, I'm just gonna follow this road and I hope that I find a warehouse pretty soon. Man, I'm finding- oh, there we go. There's a warehouse. I was saying, I'm finding a lot of rundown buildings, but no warehouses. But way over there is a warehouse. Watch there be an actual boss at this warehouse. I don't know if this is a warehouse I've been to before or not. We might see the tape bots have respawned. Or it's just a new warehouse and I never killed them. But how ironic would that be if we find a boss at an actual warehouse? <laughs> Alright, the sun's gonna set soon. Um, but maybe inside the warehouse that might not matter. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go around the outside, loot anything I can, shoot any tape bots I can, like that guy right there, and then we're gonna head inside. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Do you see this? He's right here at the where, just like I said, the, the irony, the irony. I cannot believe this. He's at the warehouse. I went to two different warehouses looking for a boss. I had to go out and find one on my own and then I get to the warehouse with a key and there's a boss at it You know what? We're gonna take him out, too. We're gonna take this guy out, too. We aren't gonna have another warehouse key, okay? I cannot believe that. He's just waiting here for me All right, we're gonna get a lot of shots in from here. Look at this run straight at me. Come on He's stuck. No, he's not. I don't think he is. He's stuck. Oh, we got him. Anybody counting how many shots we're using? This is perfect. I'm using so much potatoes right now, though. We got him. Easy mo- <gasps> Are you serious? Did that just happen? I cannot believe that just happened. I killed the big bad boss, and then two hits from a tape bot, and I'm dead. But thankfully our car was right here, so we came prepared. All right, did he have a warehouse key? Wait, what? Oh, okay, there it is. There it is. All right, I have 104 spuds left, so he took a decent chunk of ammo to kill. Probably at least 50. All right, I'm gonna do an experiment. This might, I might regret this, but I wanna see. There's a tape bot over here. Where'd you go? Dang it. All right, it takes two hits with uh, the hammer for the tape bot. I, I did not expect to die there. I thought I was going to catch him off guard, then the bush blinded me. All right, inventory is pretty clean now. It is time to go into the warehouse. Oh, I should have put those bearings back, but oh well. Oh, here we are. Here is the key card. <gasps> here we go. Um. Oh, there we go. Place warehouse key. Use. Are you excited? I'm excited. What if there's a boss that just comes out right now? Okay. <laughs> Wait, what? What? In case of emergency, break glass. It's a banana. I can't even break the glass. What are you talking about? Okay, well, let's go ahead. There we go. We're going up. Is this a real elevator? This is awesome. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready for these tape bots. Okay. Okay. Okay, here we go. My game froze. Oh! That, that scared me. I thought I crashed my game going into the warehouse. All right, so look at all this. Look at all this stuff. So I think... 
I hear bots, but I think, yeah, I can't drag anything. I can't even place a toilet seat down. So toilet seat, toilet seat method strategy cannot work in here. But I wonder if there is an encryptor somewhere, if we break it, can we literally take all of this stuff? Because this is like, these are materials. These are legitimate building materials. This entire warehouse is made out of actual building materials. Oh, I can do this. Okay, that's interesting. All right, it is dark in here. It is really dark in here. I have no idea why I'm in here. Like, what am I even looking for? I hear the tape bots walking. All right, I'm just gonna follow the open paths first. I can't, I don't think I, oh, can I take that stuff? I can't even take, what? I can't even take this stuff. All right, yeah, there has to be an encryptor on this place. Are there secret tunnels? Okay, no. Where to go? Oh, wait, 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 wait. No. No, this doesn't work. This is so interesting. All right, I think we got to break through here. That would, oh, it's tape. There's tape barriers. Oh, are you kidding me? All right, you're dead. Come on. Show yourself. Oh! This is bad. You know why this is so bad? My spud gun. No, my spud gun stays on me, but my loot my loot bag is going to be in the middle of a room full of tape bots and two hits and they kill me. Uh-oh. Whew. That was a little bit scary. All right. This is um this is this is actually really really difficult. This is this is going to be intense. I'm really glad I keep my spud gun on me, but we have to not die cuz I think if I What? Oh my where do they all come from? Did midnight happen and they respawn? Oh, I have no ammo. I can't even get in without dying. Wait, I don't even see my loot chest marker. They're guarding the entrance. What do I do? I didn't even think about the lack of ammo. I cannot get my, I cannot get it. I don't have any buildings. Oh, right, hold on, hold on. Okay, all right, new. There's a new strategy that needs to happen. You need to keep ammo in your car. If you have, if you're using the bed on your car, you need to keep potato ammo in your car for when you die. Why did I not think of this? I totally, oh man, that was a total oversight. All right, I'm bringing, uh, I have to bring building blocks. I need defenses. Please tell me I left some potatoes here. I didn't leave any potatoes here. I may have messed this up really bad. I may have lost everything I had on me, which thankfully I think it wasn't a lot. All of my potatoes are gone. I'm gonna die. These guys are gonna kill me right away if they see me. I just gotta be sneaky. Oh no, they see me. Oh, I'm dead. I'm so 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 dead. I don't, I'm, I'm dead. I, I lose, I lose everything. I just lost all the materials now. All the materials that I just took, I lose. Are they still there? Please tell me that. Oh, oh, they're still there. There's no way. There's no way to get around this. The best I can do is try to sneak. I don't know if they can see through bushes. <laughs> I am so dead. My toilet is gone and everything. You have any idea how valuable that toilet was? These guys have so much damage. I don't even have any food left. I'm gonna die. Okay, it looks like I snuck around. Please don't. No, don't come this way. Please don't see me. I don't know what their sight range is. Oh, dang. no, go, go, go. go. Oh, no, 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 no. 
I'm so dead. All right, he's dead. He's dead. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. No. All right, I killed him. I killed him. No, no, not you. I will not die to a greenie. Oh, okay. All right, there's that. I got some building materials back. I have no food though. I'm going to die of hunger and I'm going to keep respawning back there. All right, let's just go in. We got to go in right now. All right. We got to wait for this. I'm getting hungry now too. And my health is already down and it doesn't regenerate because I'm hungry. So I need to get to that loot, my, my bag and get, no, my bag's not going to be there because I died. I think that's how it works. I don't think my bag is going to be there with all that stuff and all my ammo, which means I cannot. Oh, it is there. All I have to do is get to it. Please don't see me. I can't build in here. Oh, I was going to build walls in here. Oh. <laughs> I got stuff. I got my stuff. Oh, yes. Okay, so now I'm going back to my car and I'm dropping off ammo. I think that's the best course of action right now. All right, if you shift and right click, you can start breaking down the stack. I'm going to give myself 20 bullets, 20 spuds to come back with. All right, we're back. We have backup spud ammo in the car. And now I really need to play this very, very conservative. I need to sneak. I need to make sure I'm looking, covering all my directions for enemies. No! Oh man, 55 damage. You can't even take two hits from these guys. I don't know if crouching actually works for anything. Oh, okay. Nope, maybe not. Come on. How is that not hitting him? There we go. I'm wasting more shots than I want to. I just want it to be one shot, one kill. What am I even looking for in here? There's a loot chest. Please don't be any enemy. This is the bathroom. Oh! All right. Oh, this, this shooting scares me after they die. I think someone else is shooting at me all the time. But I can't pick anything up. Use- <laughs> Look at this toilet! We have a new toilet! And it flushes too. We got plungers. Look at these ducks. All right. Oh, open door. Thank you. All right, here we go. Back exploring. I I don't know if going slow is the strategy. I feel like movement is the strategy. So I'm going to break this uh, tape thing open. All right. Oh, 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 oh. I see something. I see something. Look at this. Look at this. I can't, I can't, I can't break any of this stuff though. Oh man, I thought I, f what? Nothing shows up on the connection tool either. There's a lot more about these warehouses than I think I'm aware of right now. I hear one. There we go. Any more over here? I'm really worried I'm going to miss something since I don't even know what I'm looking for. It makes it so much harder. Like, or so much easier to miss things. I just, I am overwhelmed with like, I just like overstimulation right now. So many new things and looking for something. But what? So I'm thinking that if there's an encryptor somewhere that's going, that I'm going to unlock the building basically and unlock the ability to loot this building, I probably have to destroy it with my hammer or spud gun. Can I? Okay. Well, why? He's, oh, can I shoot through here? Oh, he takes two hits. I wonder, can you get hit with the spud gun after he dies and it starts shooting? That would be so frustrating if that's how you die. Oh, I can't. I can't destroy that. That's just, you just walk through it. There's totally a guy above me. Oh, here we go. Oh man, the, that just takes so much. Okay, now I think, oh, oh, he's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me if he hits me. I cannot take a hit from this guy. 
Did I kill him? I think I killed him. I need to heal, or I'm gonna eat. I think the uh, the fuller your hunger is, the faster you heal. I think we're clear up here. Oh, what? That guy just took like three hits, I swear. I think we have to aim for the head. It seems like I, I can do one hit kills when it's a headshot sometimes, unless it's one of those taped up ones with like the tape helmet. But uh, legs definitely do less damage, it seems like. That's interesting because I don't think that that's the case for the other Oof, farm bots. All right, headshot here. There we go. That was a one hit shot. Wow. <gasps> oh, that's his head. <laughs> that's a new area. Okay, I think that's where I got to go. And there's a bot right there. He's, he's got the helmet. No, 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 no. How does he see? They're so erratic. What? I got, oh, we shot each other. I shot him right after he shot and his tape still hurt me. Anything over here? Nope. There's an expl- Did that just un tell me that unlocked something? No. Oh, look at that. Look at that material. That is interesting. You think I can, I can't even get, oh, oh, oh. No, I can't get up there. Okay, it is still a one shot on the uh, headshot on the ones with tape on their faces. So I think that we just need to get headshots and everyone will die with one hit. What? What? What is going on in here? What? What is happening? Where am I? Where is this going? Oh my god, this goes up so high. And it like stops off at different levels. Look at this. I can get up here too? How, which way do I go? There's so many ways. All right, that goes back down. Wait, can I? No. All right, I'm gonna keep going up that spiral though. All right, I think we're at the top. Wait, then it goes back down over here. Where am I right now? What is happening? It just keeps going. I'm lost. I am so lost. I'm just walking around some vents. So I thought I was going. Did I just make it back to where? No, this is somewhere else, isn't it? Oh, are you kidding me? This is the other room I was already in. All right. So this is just a way to get to different rooms, I guess. I mean, I thought this was like a secret pathway to get to the encryption room or whatever. If that's even a thing. I'm just assuming it is. Oh, I just noticed these are the propellers that we saw. Oh no, my last carrot. Oh, I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die inside. All right, we cannot, uh, we cannot mess around anymore. We have to get, we have to get somewhere. We have to actually get where we need to get. All right. I hear someone. I didn't go in this direction yet. There's the thing. I need food. I hear I think he's above me, above these stairs. Where? 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 Oh. oh, that was close. Look at all this stuff. Can I go? Man, I don't know if I'm supposed to go all the way up there or just keep... Utility. <gasps> Utility sounds... Utility. He still hit me? These guys are OP. These guys are so OP. Oh, 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 elevator? For what? Is this, is this another entrance? This is not. What is this, ele is, this is not the elevator I came in because that's blocked. I, this better be where I need to go. If I die in here, this is gonna be really, really bad because I'm gonna be so lost trying to find my way back with that limited ammo to my, to my, uh... Oh, this is going up. Oh, we're going up higher. Oh, this is it. We got to keep finding the elevators to go up and up. Oh, no. We're just on another floor now. That means that there's going to be a whole new mess of bots. I did not come with enough materials for this. Office? Office? 
No! Oh. Oh, man. They do too much damage. They do way too much damage. This office better be where I'm supposed to be. Some of this stuff looks important. So there's that. How much potatoes do I have? Oh, I have 28 potatoes left? Oh man, he's right there! Can I shoot through this? Go ahead, come on, come on, break it for me. Break it for me. Come on. Oh no, he's gonna kill me, isn't he? Because I have to break that and then immediately switch back. Unless I waste a spud on it. But I don't feel like I have the privilege to do that right now. Alright, ready? There we go. Alright, we're doing okay so far. Remember the trailer? And it zoomed in on a power, like a thing with electricity sign on it. I think that's what we're trying to find here. Where do I go? No! Oh, I'm so dead! Oh, man. Oh, that is rough. It's gonna take a lot. I do the. I don't know if they respawn. Like all the ones in the lower level. I don't know if they respawn. So now I have 20 bullets to get myself back there and no food. All right, nothing spawned around the entrance this time. So I don't even know how I got to that first elevator inside, but I gotta find my way back there somehow. All right, now here's the ultimate question. Did the bots that I've already defeated come back? Here we go. Okay. This is a good sign so far. I don't think that they're back. So I think I went this way. Oh, I found it. That was actually pretty quick. I found the elevator, no tape bots. I heard one tape bot that I remember leaving behind, but he didn't see me, I didn't see him, so we're all good. And now we have the problem, if I die again, there's no more ammo on the car. So we need to, I need to just do a whole couple nights of just potato farming. But actually I need other food too, so... Uh, this game's get. this game's getting real. This game is getting really, really real. Okay, just don't mess it up this time, Scrapman. Okay, nothing in that direction. You know what? I'm picking up my stuff right now. That's how you do it. All right, we have 40 bullets. Come on, shoot your head. Oh! Still got a hit. They respawn so quick with their firing. All right, uh, what can I eat and drink? This is it. This is all I have left. This is my entire life depends on all that. Please find me some more food. Oh, lockers. Please, please be something. Ah, uh, something in any of these lockers. Oh, man. Yes, food, food, food. A pine... I'm gonna... Ha I want pineapples. I'm gonna have to eat this. I'm gonna try not to, though. I really need to save pineapples. That's how I... That's how we can get a spuddling gun, is with a pineapple. No, no. That was a waste. I should have, I panicked and I shot and missed. I should have just lined up my shot. I wasted two extra spuds. What is that? Do I go there or do I keep going up? All right, I don't think I can do anything with that. I don't know if I can get back up if I go down there. So I kind of don't want to. It doesn't look like, the, it just looks like a construction site, you know? Oh, oh, there we go. We can get up. All right, let's go down then. All right, I don't actually see anywhere. I don't see anywhere to go down here. Oh, wait, I'm going somewhere down here. It's happening. Where is this leading me? It's like a maze. It's going, it is going far. Are you kidding me? It's a dead end? Oh man, that was such a waste of hunger. I think, uh, I think your hunger consumption is tied to how much movement you're doing. So that was a huge waste of my resources here. I am like, I am stretched thin right now. 
Oh, 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 he's moving so much. He got a hit on me. <sighs> Anyone else really stressed right now? I am. This is not the scrap mechanic I remember. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. How many floors? I think three. I think I remember there being three tiers on the building on the outside. So this could be the end. The last floor. All right, I'm going to eat my pineapple. I have broccoli? Broccoli's amazing. When did I get broccoli? Look at how much hunger the broccoli does. Thank you. All right, this is the last floor. If I die up here, I'm going to be so sad. So sad. One like equals one success, guys. Here we go. I hear them. I'm getting shot. I'm getting- Ah! 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 No! No, no, no! 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 I'm just gonna- uh, uh. <laughs> Don't- Don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. I'm just gonna hide under the floorboard for a little bit. Oh my- How does he- He's so quick! I really wanted to save the pineapple, but I have to eat it. Oh, that was horrible! Pineapple is horrible for hunger. He sounds like he's over here. There we go. Oh my god, I'm surrounded right now. All right, I got him. Oh, oh, he's coming after me. He's coming after me. Okay, he's stuck. Ready? Do this very carefully. There we go. All right. That went well. Yes, yes, yes. More food. More food. A pineapple. I need hunger. I need, like, I need a vegetable. All right, we're continuing down this hallway. This place... So much bigger than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Look at the shadows. They're so creepy. Oh, man. They hit me every time. Oh, he's gonna get me. Oh, that was close. That was really close. That was really close. I flubbed that shot pretty bad. I have 13 bullets left, people. I think we're on the last floor. Will these 13 bullets and this very, very bad lack of resources sustain me to wherever I'm even going? I don't even know. Oh my goodness, they're everywhere. <sighs> No, thank you. Ooh, right over the shoulder. than carrot. Oh, man. Guys, I, this is too much. This is like actually too much. Which direction do I even go? We go that way. Or this way. I'm gonna go this way. Guys, these it's a maze. It's it's just it's an absolute maze in here. Nope. He's coming after me now. Oh! I'm out! <gasps> I'm out! I'm all out! I'm all out! I'm dead. 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 I'm so... Ah, oh, man. Just because I missed. We're all out of... We're all out of spuds. We're all out of food. We're all out of life. We're losing our toilet seat. We're losing 10 component pieces. We're losing everything that was in our inventory, which is, that's not a lot, but. Okay, so we determined that this place is extremely dangerous and we came very underprepared. What we're gonna have to do is prepare. So for the next episode in between, I'm gonna farm a bunch of potatoes and a bunch of other food 
So we take an elevator up there, and we go up there, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, five! There's like five floors to this thing? Are you kidding me? It's not fair, I'm telling you. All right, well, make sure you guys are subscribed because we're not leaving this thing alone. I'm gonna be doing this again. We're gonna figure out how to get through this warehouse. We're gonna do it for real all the way, all right? So hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and uh, wish me luck in my preparations for next time. If you want to follow survival from the beginning in order, make sure you check out the playlist, the whole playthrough right out here on the end screen. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.